Rando fans, prepare for ludicrous speed! Hi, Kairos! Hello. Are you prepared for ludicrous speed? I'm ready. Hopefully, we got lots of money to get us going, kicking off real fast. Kairos, why don't you tell the people why I'm telling them to prepare for ludicrous speed? Because uh, we are in a, I believe, our final version of this se session of the Champion's Choice, and we have added Rupee Speed Go. So and, the more uh, money our runners have, the faster Link Sprite is going to move, and it can get insane! Which is exactly what we're rooting for. Are you rooting for insane, chat? Any hype emotes for insane? Very good, very good. And then we also have some other changes. This is, we started off with our, uh, our tournament flags that we have been have been very familiar with lately but then we uh turned off force ganon permanent sword beams and uh made it so that all this all the dungeons are shapes now some very fine runners ready to uh show off what they can do under these flags and we are starting all the way in the southwest Which, of course, gives us our sword, because that's what these lag sets do. We haven't changed that at all. Or hockey stick, as your sprite set may allow. I this was a uh, golf cubby. This one's the golf club. Oh, okay. Four. Dark Knight's Underworld World got a bomb drop by BBQ. Three hits on the uh, blue Octorox, that's a little bit much. And the measly 25 on the medium secret. Got an enemy road up on Death Mountain, that's usually a good sign, get you spread out. Ooh, started with Power Bracelet. Yep, this like it does give you one of the three overworld blocking items between the raft power bracelet and recorder. And no B button, so we knew it wasn't the recorder. Well, when in doubt, it gives you a destination to go towards, because if that's what the game's giving you, then that's what passed the logic test. Well, we have the minimum medium secret, but we also have the maximum minimum secret. Dare you say that three times fast. <laughs> and they almost vanilla large at 101. Uh, that's pretty basic. Come on, that was at least worth a bad chuckle. Well, one thing we don't have is uh, any levels yet. Yeah, a lot of quick overworld exploration with following up where the any roads are. And uh, we don't have a candle yet, so we can't explore those. Not all of our runners have bombs yet, so a lot of screens are being left behind so far. And uh, a couple of runners with 126 Rupees are starting to zoom. It's funny, as you could probably walk across the screen now faster than you can screen scroll, even if you're good at screen scrolling. Yeah, this rupee count, uh, it becomes almost impossible. Nothing that the second quest magical sword arrow. So no levels, no choose any, still missing white sword and old man items. And of course, no one's had a reason to go out to the coast yet, so we have no idea what's hanging out there. And no Armos item located yet. Lionel's on the overworld and dark nuts, so Wizrobes are going to be in a dungeon. I 
Honestly, I think with this flag set, I'd rather have the Dark Nuts in the dungeon with the permanent sword beams, because that does make them a little bit more friendly of the three. Yeah, and, uh, with that, with the ships on, uh, you no longer have a chance of having uh, second quest enemies. No red bubbles to deal with. So Fury should be the closest to the Armos item, because I believe we're down to the forest. And uh, H up expensive. Yep. And this should be the screen. Let's see what we get. Reading Rainbow. Take a look, it's in a book. Which that flag is still on, so uh you're gonna be able to see what the old men are saying. See if it makes it easier or harder to avoid the door pair. Ah, there's a there's a candle. <laughs> and seven ruby bombs, but uh Fury's broke. Unfortunate time to be broke. Although, Fury may be intentionally being broke to screen to help with his screen scrolls. <laughs> yeah, you can only have so much say in it. Okay, he's not intentionally being broke. <laughs> Well, he might also go back for the bombs. That was way too quick for me to tell what that I ladder item was. I think it was recorder, but it was it was just a flash. Yeah, so Fury took that twenty. Now here comes a couple bombs. Meanwhile, BBQ is in level seven. No, well, never seven until it is. I mean, the biggest thing for me is I, I want to know the enemy set. Like, if the enemy set is not stopping me, then sure, let's get through a quick seven. If it's a slog seven, you really don't want to be there. But uh, BBQ did get a hard off the floor in that seven. Fairly quickly. Gleak was doing a very poor job drive guarding it. You're guarding the wrong door. <laughs> Chaos, meanwhile, has put up a pretty good rupee count. I mean, that's blue ring territory. If you can find it. You haven't seen it yet. Or you can go really, really fast. Fast is good. Not dying is slightly better. You, you can outra outrace the, uh, the Lionel beams on the overworld? Hello, shape! I, uh, I can't help but think Roger from American Dad. I think you could also get away with Frankenstein Monster. Got, got the hands out front. Ooh, Chaos finds a candle. Otto found that blue ring with enough money to buy it, but opts for the speed instead. The desert cave has the, uh, that candle. We've got uh, chat telling us that Coast was the any key, according to Fury's replay. That's a, that's pretty nice to have, but you're going to need a ladder to get it. I, I, I knew it wasn't something that was like blue. <laughs> it was, but as I said, 
we only saw a flash on the restream. <laughs> yep. Oh yeah, that's the enemy key. Yep, you can see a lot easier that time. BBQ, meanwhile, has enough hearts to pick up that red candle upon finding it. But Op a couple of our runners have already opted that choose any for the blue candle. Uh, actually, Obno just bought a blue candle. Uh, considering where you are, it's a bad place to be without a candle. So Opna only has three hearts, so even White Sword item is... Wait. I'm confused. What are you confused about? The White Sword item is definitely a heart container. It was yeah. under that bush. Yeah, I just had in my head that the red candle was the... Anyhow. So there's a purchase. Let's put seven. There's a purchase to not die. A heart, a heart pickup by Opno for the shot. Does that count as gotta have heart? Not quite. But the, the, the feeling's there. Eighty-six for arrows. Oh, level nine. No keys for our runners either, by the way. Which happens when you don't have any time in dungeons. I mean, you can purchase one. Hey, we got another level. It's four for BBQ. And Chaos Finale is going to purchase some wood arrows. See how that pans out. No arrows, not a pan. We don't have a pan in this game. That's FF4. You signed up to do this with me. You knew what you were getting into. Yes, yes, I did. Fury finds out he's doing battle with the Frankenstein monster. And we've got bunnies for Easter. Also, Pulse Voice in level 4 for barbecue.gov. Level 5 in the Northeast. A lot of green. Kind of fitting. And that's the segmented 4. Also, chat, what's the best candy for Easter? Why is it Skittles? Ladder in five! And if Opno knows what the uh, coast item is, then we know where Opno is going. Yeah, it's difficult to make progress in these dungeons without any keys. A little bit easier if you have all the keys, though. Square block for the raft. Six for the red ring. Ingliak returns with the wand. Okay, clearly Apna does not know what the ghost item is, or you should get out of here and go get that before bothering.
Power bracelet was the item of five on the floor that we didn't need, but we get it anyways. Does that make it uh, Titan Mitts? What? Oh, you get the power glove and uh, the vest, and you get the second one that makes the Titan Mitts. How does that link to the past? Yeah. I've watched several hundred randomizers and I still know nothing. One of these days I'll figure out Zelda 2, then I'll worry about Zelda 3. Double heart and four. Chat asks, why is everybody but Fury moving at hyper speed? First of all, let's get it straight. It's ludicrous speed. And also that's because Fury is broken. Rupees increase your speed. Yep. You, you had a moderate mount 95, Opto at a little bit more 149, and Chaos Finality nearing max speed at 209. And there's Triforce level 4 for BBQ Ductive. I don't know that Fred formally named it Ludicrous Speed, but we all know he was thinking it. I think the hint is, uh, with speed like that, no wonder they kept getting that the princess. That was the hint cave that Chaos did. Dig Dogger. Level 5 on the yeah. Just make sure we're not in level 5 at the time or that hint. A lot we haven't seen yet. I mean, we found four of the levels, including nine. Opno has found the Triforce, which is reason enough to leave this five. Oh, there's level two, right next door. That'll do. Although Opno still may regret not having the, uh, the uh, key, just because you could have had it, but level two is gotta be about the friendliest for bomb walls. So there's a hint. Six is close to start. Could be a uh, recorder blocked since uh, we have already checked the power brace spot and most of the other screens around there. I wondered if that he would make Opno go left. And we also know we have a uh, recorder block dungeon. I believe it was the the raft. Level two is the Easter Bunny. Even if it's a stretch, I'm going with it for Easter. Okay, Astro is gonna grab a Triforce out of level four. Fury finds uh, the other hint shop. Boomerang. I guess that's not really French vanilla. Uh, maybe Spanish vanilla? Alright. Uh, step over the water to reach the raft, so... Could be on the, the river... But no, 
No, the raft's recorder block, so I guess it could be on the river behind a dig dogger. We just found out about that hint. Level 2 truck force for Opto Point. And I missed the middle hint if uh, Chaos Finale bought that. There's the magic sword. And uh, that letter's vanilla. Magical sword by the small lake. There's our cheap bait. And the blue ring shop. We saw blue ring earlier for uh, 232. Oh, level one. Where was that? I think this was near uh, Lost Hills waterfall area. It's marking uh, something in the. It's like, oh, there's a little one. Level one is half missing. Very condensed level one tonight. You're our second runner on stream to get the ladder. And guess we taking a line all shot to the head. Magic boomerang is power bracelet blocked, and that has to be a level. A seven's power bracelet blocked already. Well, that's probably the answer then. Not definitively, but probably. Because uh, six is your start, so it's not power bracelet blocked. Uh, we do have eight outstanding. And three? There's a white sword and one. Always nice to have that combat upgrade. Or in this case, it's the uh, the white iron. Three iron, you figure? We'll go with that. Chat says five iron. I can't argue. That might be a ten cup reference. And this is, after all, the most democratic organization in the existence of randomizers. Well, Obno's our first runner to get the uh, the ladder, and uh, it's up to nine keys, so hasn't really bothered going to get that uh, magic magical key. Okay, so there you go. It's uh, one east of five, vanilla five. Indeed. There's a the bow. On the floor. Oh, we're collecting things. Yeah, yeah, that bow might not be required since. Yeah, I mean, it could be required, but might not be. It can also just make your life easier. I, I'm not one to go around buying the arrows without the bow, but when you have it, it's a good way to deal with a bunch of pulse voices. And final item in one is a heart container. DBQ finds level two. I wonder if Opno 
has not been to the coast. And if you haven't been, I'm not sure why you wouldn't. I mean, eight, it's not a pressing demand, but you also know you're going to use more than eight keys the rest of this seed. In all likelihood. No checks before getting the uh, our last uh, found taking cave. This has to get a heart. Quick letter check, perhaps, making sure that yeah, I did pick that up. There is eight top of the waterfall. So pretty sure level three is the only one where we don't know where it is. So I think I know where six is. Uh, wouldn't you know it? Little eight is trap. Those rooms in a shoot room. Fun times! If you're enjoying those sword beams against Gliok, it does improve Gliok significantly. As Chaos Finale is going to grab that ladder out of five! Thanks for hanging out with us, Chad. Hope you've had a good Sunday, whatever you've been up to. There you go, you see a room full of poles voice, and it's like, man, it'd be nice to have bow and arrows here. Guria grumbles on Death Mountain. Yeah, Chaos Finale does have all the keys now. And there's that wand out of eight, it is the floor item. First quest eight would be one on the floor, two in the stairs. I always felt like that square block room was like the most random thing they put in. Like, why? Well, if you if you don't uh, flip past it, uh, it definitely does restrict access. I think it's a bunch of keys that end up going in that room, but it, it, it just lets enemies sit somewhere where you can't hit them. Ever. Oh, wait, wait, wait. you're talking about the, uh, the the circles blocks? Yeah. I thought it went to the turn style. <laughs> no, the turn style's fine. It's a, it's, an, it's a concept. I never mind games exploring concepts, even if they don't quite work out right. Just the idea you're trying, I can appreciate it. Art container in two that you need a ladder for. Yep, on Opno was able to get that one. Out of bombs, maybe trying to force the random drop. So I'm not really only the, the only one covering ground that is new to us right now. Yeah, 
all the other runners are in the dungeons that Opno has the Triforce pieces for. Opno's been on a roll in these weeklies. Ten keys for Opno. I mean, the seed has been very generous about this. I'll see where the magic key is free. drop in uh, this little light. Well, perhaps to no surprise, it's a segment at eight. And the seed just continues to give keys. a taunt at this point. Uh, yes, this is all shapes. It was the, uh, one of the previous flag changes. The most recent, of course, is the rupee speed. I can't think of anything Easter to get out of this shape, so I'm just gonna go with it's a Metroid. We started with turning flags with this series. It is no longer. Well, if you just started watching in the recent tournament, then first of all, welcome. But second of all, that would throw you off when you start seeing things that you've uh, never seen before. And uh, level three is right next to eight, bottom of the waterfall. So we can definitely put the the raft in. Uh, sorry, it was the magical boomerang. I think was blocked by the feet of strength. Quick triforce in three for fury, but I have to imagine you're going back in, not knowing the uh, items here. Tander and a stare and eight. A couple more, you'd have a shot at Max. It's not out of the realm of possibility. That's the best we got for now. I don't really think the magical sword pickup was anywhere convenient, so even if we had enough hearts, I don't think we're going to see it. Especially uh, now when you already got the white sword. The yeah, magical sword is, uh, Southeast burn bush of the small lake. Yes, I'm saying I don't think that's convenient to anything else that we would go buy it again. It's only two screens away from, uh, or no, three screens away from our supposed level six. <laughs> Which, by the way, is, uh, Thing gonna be. Uh, we're looking for that recorder. Alright, so Abno and Fury are working through eight. Fury made a liar out of me when it came to three. No, I gotta admit, that confuses me. Why would you want to dig 8 before 3? Because you don't have the Triforce yet? I mean, he already... He took the quick Triforce out of 3, didn't go back for items. Right.
Fury did not get the uh, the white sword out of one, but did get the bow. That's a lot to be leaving behind, so I... Fury must be... thinking, go fast as I can, try to get to nine, and see if I can just find Zelda. There we go, in the... Well, that third room from the top of the eight column, we get our Triforce out of level eight. Ropno. All right, Zopto, remember to check this screen here, because this is where three is. Yes. Why not take a free key when you got the chance? BBQ and Chaos Finale, getting those Triforce pieces out of level five. Triforce was to the south in this three. None of those walls bombs, so that room's just a total waste of time. There's Triforce. Opto gets it right away. And Otto is sitting at the maximum rupee count for maximum speed, and he's jetting. Literally. Wow, I'm really surprised to leave three behind. What? What the? I wonder what the dungeon Otto hasn't found besides six. Because. Maybe he hasn't been to four yet. So here's the thing. If you need the recorder, I don't understand leaving three behind. This is the part that I'm struggling with. Right, because I think everybody probably has seen that Goma uh, uh, as close to start, and you know you've checked everything there, I think. But it may also be just that we have, uh, you know, information of everybody. Well, I mean, even if you don't have a recorder hint, you don't have the raft either, and you're missing a dungeon. So you've got two possible blocks that you don't have a solution for, and a short dungeon. I mean, it could literally be the next item behind that key door. Alright, PDQ with the heart container, just missing the white sword out of this one. Up to 11 hearts. Got a chance at that magical sword. And with speed like this, it might be, uh... You know, a few screens away is not that far away. Thirteen keys. How high can we go? I feel like the most I ever did was seventeen. Finale picks up another Triforce out of level 2. Fury has taken the transport, which is required to get the uh, Triforce out of this level 8. It's all the way over to the rightmost column, but you have to take the transport to get here.
Fury also at nine keys does have knowledge of. We we know Fury was over on that screen. First one to go over to see the see that magical key. BBQ, second runner to get the uh, white sword. Okay, it's getting that heart container here up to nine hearts. BBQ uh, matches. Uh, nope, went, went, went shy on the uh, nose Triforce count. Been able to make pretty good progress, and certainly doesn't hurt to get the combat upgrades. And for level 9, that was one of the first two dungeons we found. And Triforce out of 4 for out, no! Yeah, the recorder could be uh, buried in eight. I think I don't. I think we only saw one heart container in a staircase, uh, but most likely it's in that level three. I mean, the other thing that is outstanding is the silver arrows, which are, of course not required if you're not required Ganon, but. It can still speed things up because it is a long-range attack damage with magical sword damage levels. And while well, again is not required, technically he could still be required if uh, blocking the only path to the princess. All right, thanks for our tracker, GXB Adam. Hitting those buttons tonight and verifying that we did only see a heart container and that wand in level 8. That's a big 8. I understand leaving an item behind in A. I don't understand it for 3. I should clarify, of course, that all of these runners are infinitely better at this game than I am. I'm just a thinker. That strategery. Sure, we'll go with that. All right, Fury is out of this level eight now, and are we going to return to level three? I mean, it's right here. Nope. Walks right past it. <laughs> Maybe we get a little lull here, so let's give some shout-outs. Hi, Kiki. Hi, Vincent. Hi, Jackson. Hi, Melee Wizard. Hi, Vincent. Hi, Good Guy. Hi, Rax. Sean. Hi, Freedom Fighter. Hi, Silva. Yeah, bot's probably not working. We had a little technical difficulties right before the stream. Hi, Look a Thing. Hi, Domino. Hi, Walrum. Hi, anyone else who I'm missing, but that covers chat for a while. All right, right hand side of our stream has BBQ, uh, of and Chaos Finale in level eight again. Oh, for, uh, for the first. Starting here, whereas Opto and Fury are no longer there. Let's see. Fury sh should have seen five. Might be still looking for seven. There's level no seven. Yeah, we, yeah, uh, yeah. One of our runners was up there real early. Or real early, I think it might have been BBQ. Yeah, Opno has basically got to be gambling recorder is here. But there's a heart container, and if, uh, I don't know if Opno bought hints. Uh, so, come in and chat about not having Ganon required. Anything that throws off the meta and the strategy can really mess with you and make you rethink the game in ways you otherwise wouldn't. So, 
now instead of bow being absolutely required and you're digging dungeons until you find it you might say without hands just say okay well i'm probably going to need a ladder and then really not look for items otherwise you might just be triforce and going all the dungeons going as quick as you can until the game stops you little things like that can really change the experience and as we're seeing here this uh seed is definitely forcing you to do certain digs of the dungeons just to access this level six for example So the, the, the fight to get into level 9 is the most important part of the seed so far. So Abno doing his battle with the Frankenstein monster, trying to find out what level 7 has, find that Triforce, and then where are you going to look next for that recorder? My county, we got uh, two heart containers outstanding, and the uh, items left on our tracker. With, we know that the red ring is in six, and as well as the raft. Welcome to the party, Yusuke. This is uh, one race involving about 20 something runners. We've got four of them featured for us tonight. And uh, we're just here having some fun with the weekly. I mean, there's a, there's a chance the raft could be behind a dig dogger in one of our remaining locations, but probably isn't. That would either have to be three that we haven't seen, or a really weird eight setup. I'm going to assume that that was uh, the first heart container that everybody else has found so far. BBQ. Two runners and eight, one and seven, one and four, we're all over the place. Oh, a BBQ at 13 heart, 80% chance of picking up that magical sword should he choose to go try. Gotta have heart. By the way, just random trivia, do you know why the Frankenstein monster walked with the, the arms outstretched like that? Not to say I do not. He's blind! After the first movie, there was a fire and in storyline that made him blind, so every other movie he walked like that because he couldn't see. Alright. Magic boomerang in seven. Yep, we had a hint for that based on the feat of strength. Ooh, bomb upgrade. I think I'd want that more than the speed. Alright, Fury, no good on 11. No, oh, But we appreciate the try. Drive Force 7, seven for Opno. And yes, the more rupees you have, the faster the runners go, so Fury wants to be low on money, and the other runners want lots of money. Different strategies, different approaches. Opto finds level 9. 
<laughs> Just hadn't been in that neck of the woods, I guess. Since getting the candle. BBQ is closing on the Triforce from level 8. And uh, it, it appears that most of our runners, uh, they they go to level 8 above at the top of the waterfall before they check the bottom of the waterfall, which has level 3. Yeah, Avno clearly doesn't have all the hints. And that makes sense with what we're seeing. Opno making choices about keeping rupees instead of buying bomb upgrades for the speed, so didn't invest in hints. But uh, this looks like Opno's going back to three. I, I was thinking Opno was still searching, but that could also have been searching for choose anys. I've, I've tracked all four of them, so... But and that doesn't mean yeah. Opno did. That's correct. Okay, so up is a dead end, down is where the Triforce is, and Kidor is progress in level three. Question chat, has no one dug three yet? Nope, we've seen two runners nope out after they got the Triforce. This is our first look at it. Yeah, Opto being one of those runners that noped out of the rest of the raid to begin with. Novo Hayo for Fury. This is a batch of boomerang at the uh, 51 minute mark. There's the red candle on the floor. Still a staircase item to find in three. I believe that is the second heart, because, uh, BBQ already... Yeah, that is definitely the second heart out of eight. Uh, so... We are definitely having the recorder here, because we have seen everything else. Fury's got the Triforce out of seven. And BBQ has it out at level eight. There is the recorder, as foretold, in level three. Hey, even I get things right occasionally. Keeps everybody surprised. Uh, so nine's gonna have the silvers and a heart container. I have no idea what that is, so I'm gonna guess Kirby music. Uh, I think that was Superman theme. Uh, yeah, Chris Reeve uh, boobies. I'm not getting Superman out of that, but all right. Okay, chat says I'm wrong. All right, you with the trick quick Triforce out of three. Where are we going to dig there? As Opno is in level six right now. That's a pretty big six. Yes, but we're only looking for Triforce, so... Red ring, yeah, probably not in a non gaining required, and we're this deep into it. Well, you pick up if you find it. All right, Fury heading back to level five or two. I'm also really bad at flute songs. The only one that I ever get is Spanish Flea. Hi, 
I'm still amazed that in a scene where the magic key was free, Anna <laughs> has gone through all of the dungeons without the magic key. Fury is not far behind at eight keys. All right. PBQ picks up the red candle off the floor, is digging this level three. As was intended. Oh, that says, have a heart. prioritize what they prioritize. We see the big difference in strategies with Otto wanting all the money and Fury wanting none of it. And by the way, Opno was the one who chose this flag with the rupee speed increase. Okay, Opno got the compass, then we had a stream stutter, but I think Op didn't know I know. But uh, now knows where that Triforce is and gets a red ring for the trouble. Well, go ahead and take that. I mean, it's right there. <laughs> Certainly, I s said I don't know that it would be worth spending the time to search for it, but if you happen to find it anyways, then by all means. Uh, back for level three, as uh, BBQ did get the recorder out of there. A little more efficient, but still has to clear seven as well. Oh, getting boxed in by the dark nuts on the overworld BBQ. And full Triforce for Apno. Onward to level nine. So, what are we looking for this time? A door that opens. And if things go badly? Pride? Yeah, yeah but we'll have to find the silvers that are, are in level 9 and if, if things go terribly awry with this flag set. I mean, that's a matter of perspective. I think that's what chat's rooting for. That wouldn't be going wrong. Yeah, it could be a bomb wall in this office room with this uh, setting. All right, starting in the nine column. And uh, zoom, zoom, zoom. Of course, those robes are in nine. They had to be. And we got magical sword for BBQ. Well, and a GG for Oppo. GG. Well, that was well, that was easy once you get into level nine. <laughs> Uh, let's see, that is good to put Opno in third place. Angel FM picked up the win. That was a 51 minutes. Chesterk had some heart. Second place with 56 minutes. Opno coming in third place with a 57. Potato Pony was not far behind with another 57. Yeah, 15 seconds there. <laughs> First level night ever from chat. Ah. Uh. There we go, Superman. All right, so Fury is in level three to get the recorder. BBQ is entering level six right now, but still gotta go to seven. Okay, let's get a spot check. Oh. Welcome into the booth, Opno Point GG. Hi, thanks. Chat's disappointed with that nine. We may need to run back. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, pretty quick. The so trick quick. was getting in there. <laughs> yeah, nine was so fast. I think uh, I took a while to realize. Oh, hey, I wasn't ready with the, with the done button. 
Speaking of fast, you clearly were enjoying the ludicrous speed. Uh, I think you even passed on a bomb upgrade to keep your speed up. <laughs> yeah, there was like two bombs and uh, max rupee that wanted to go, still go fast. So was uh, 9 the last dungeon that you needed to find? Or did you uh, find it earlier and retry it? Uh, I last uh, uh, when, I, when I was missing, I was in four dungeon when I was done with level eight, and three of them I had a hint for. I knew that seven was on Death Mountain, four was on the, uh, nine was in the Dead Woods, and six was close to start. So I was really missing four. But the only spot I had left and close to start uh, after burning the bushes was the recorder spot. And level three was the only dungeon I had items left somehow. And this was such an oddball seed. Have you ever had one where the magic key was free like that and you never picked it up? <laughs> I've probably had a few of those, but not often. I kind of forgot it was there until I found the lighter. Like, suddenly I was at like 9 keys and never got down to below 10 after that. I didn't really need the magical key. Well, did you uh, have fun with the evolving flag set? Yeah, it was fun. No, I wasn't expecting to change most of them during the mod. Kind of hard to find. I, I, like I like that we even saw some variety of what we usually get out of the changes. It felt like everybody was trying to uh, pick on a flag that really doesn't get a lot of love. Yeah, that's why I picked permanent sword game as uh, my first I won the second week. Because it's a flag I don't see often other outside of random percent. Alright, so our remaining runners on stream are trying to put the uh, final pieces of the puzzle together. Yuri just entering level 6. BBQ in level 6, but still needs to go to 7 again. That sure was a map for level 6. Do you have... Another finisher we have stolen, finishing in fifth with a 102.49. I think six took some of the rooms from one and two. <laughs> hey, there was the raft. Yeah, we had a full item knowledge between the hints and the quite full exploration. Red ring in level 6 was pretty nice at the end. I almost skipped that room because I found the, the compass. I figured, eh, I might as well check, just in case it's the red ring. And it was. And there's Triforce for BBQ! Only runner at least so far to pick up the magical sword, but when there's not a lot of combat left, it's hard for it to be a difference maker for you. I almost want that to be an option. Swap uh, white sword and magic sword.
As Fury continues to dodge all of the money. The compass is very soon to be found here. And Chaos picks up level 7 Triforce. Not a lot for us to say at this point, just runners having to clean up things they haven't done yet. Okay, as a finale, that means getting the Triforce out of six. Speaking of six, sixth place is uh, Dr. JPHD with a 104.39. Fury <laughs> despawned the Ruby boss. <laughs> And Triforce at a level 6. Alright. Fury has all the pieces. Has all the pieces and ready to go and take that quick jaunt to the princess. Hopefully. Yep. Missed the red ring, but probably won't very be very helpful in the little nice yeah, the... four rooms. Yeah, Fury it's possible that. he goes the wrong way in nine. Maybe. Veer is using that awesome one rupee speed increase. Well, these creeps are all. <laughs> yeah, the only way you can go in the wrong way in level 9 is like making a possible staircase in the first two rooms. Because the already a few bomb on the door. Here we go, level 9, uh, going up. Take that left. Yeah, no reason to fight those whiz ropes. <laughs> or those. Yeah, so unless you went to bomb wall, you were finding Zelda. And GG to Fury. Fury is gay finishing in seventh place with the time of 107.06. GG. And welcome to the booth, Fury SK. GG. Had one rupee just in case you had to shoot an arrow at Ganon. Appreciate that. I didn't pick up the wood arrows left to be. Yeah, I don't know. Just didn't pick, uh, didn't pick to dig three. I guess that was kind of important in the end. That was one of your later dungeons, wasn't it? Uh, uh, seven, five, two, one, three, eight, four, and then had to go dig a flea. So about halfway. Okay. Game teased you with that early Triforce. Yep. And BBQ close to wrapping this up. That big magic sword advantage for combat in this so tedious level 9. Don't tell me that's a staircase, though. No. Okay, <laughs> it is a staircase, but uh, just take the path and get your GGs out for bbq.gov. 
GG. I think everybody who goes into that room has the same reaction of, wait, what? <laughs> the, the real battle was getting into Nine. Yeah, I think Angel's finish gave it away that uh, Nine was not going to be brutally bad. At least for me. Uh, let's see, we had a whole bunch right after Fury, so Sis Crusher, Chess Sandy, Eat My Steel, Magic Friends, and BBQ.gov finishing in 12th of the 109. I'll take the wild guess that I had the slowest link the entire time, pretty much. Oh yes, most definitely. With speed I like that, uh, no wonder again, and get out the princess, I believe the hint. And, uh, welcome bbq.gov, GG. GG's everybody! GG. I always appreciate a good magic sword pickup. I mean, at that point, I kind of had to do it, right? I mean, I, I was guaranteed it, and I didn't want to take any chance of getting slowed down by Wizrobe Combat in 9, which ended up being a non-issue. Like, oh, look, Wizrobe's high, bye. Well, then you push that block and it's the staircases, and I'm like, no, no, no staircase! No staircase here! You just never know. That's just, I just pushed it just to have information that it was, in fact, a staircase. So, what, what Say ended up saving me a lot of time, I think, I mean, you guys tell me if I'm wrong, but I think that hint that I got about six being near start once I had the book. Uh, because I had cleared everything else out of start except for the recorder spot. So I knew I had to, d I knew six was recorder blocked. So that's why I went back into three and dug because I, I was looking specifically for a recorder at that point. Yeah, and I think you had, you had all the rest of the dungeon information at that point too, right? I did, yeah. I, I knew I had gotten the hint that three was along the river. So that's why I routed in the. Uh, Lost Hills and everything, because I figured it was one of those bomb spots along the river. It turns out it was the waterfall. Uh, but yeah, th at that point, I knew where si I knew I had information for six and three, but they were the two levels I hadn't seen yet. Uh, Fury, I think you were the only one of the forerunners on stream that actually found three before eight. That's an interesting play by most, I guess. I, don't know. I always check the waterfall before going up. It was not fun at all. No, I, I, I did I see every room in eight? I didn't see a map, so I don't know how many I still have left. Meanwhile, was... Chaos Valley is in level nine for now. Get past these wizard robes and get your GG's up for Chaos Finale. And the stab. Running, fin finishing out in 15th place with a 112.18. In between, we had a custom and... Eat my steel and Hyo twenty four. Yeah, so Fury 8's map was gross. I know, uh, I was my steels earlier. But, yeah. Oh, so, oh, sorry, Kairos. Uh, eight's map was gross, uh, and I think I saw every room. Seven's map looked like uh, it looked like a cartoon character wearing like one of those sleeping caps and carrying a candle. Yeah, it went with Frankenstein monster. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I like that. Yeah, seven maps was, seven's map was really, really early, so that, that one wasn't so bad. I, uh, I have no idea which room I skipped early in eight had a map, if it was early at all. And the gang's all here. Welcome to the Boothcast finale, GG. Uh, thank you. But yeah, I spent most of my time getting to multiples of seven, so I could go to the bomb shop, buy extra bombs, get back to zero, and just play the game. That's pretty much my whole strategy this entire time, so I was never going zooming. I could clip, do what I wanted. Oh, I had so I I had so much fun zooming, uh, and then I bought a blue ring. Uh, red ring. Oh, red ring was in six. Oh man. Uh, but I bought a blue ring just as protection, and it it was like it was like you know the flash going in reverse, losing speed as you're walking through the forest you got to get to uh, yeah so that's always fun when you go from incredible speed to just normal link rupee speed is so fun like i know there are, are a lot of mixed opinions about it but it's like one of my favorite flags 
Mine too. Uh, but I did catch myself trying to clip a couple of times. I, I think what what Triforce's room was in a tea room. Is that four? Five. It was five. The dungeon five. I spent way too much time in because I forgot that a ladder was like right in the beginning. So I just kept digging and digging and digging for a basement item. Oh, yeah. I tried the ladder clip across there when I had like 150 rupees or something and then realized that was never going to work. And then I was mad that I had to go walk three rooms around and bomb. Uh, so, yeah, it, it's lots of fun until you until you outsmart yourself. <laughs> yeah, I did that, I think, in eight. eight. I, picked, I picked up a fiver on the floor so I could no longer clip. I was kind of annoyed the rest of that dungeon. Uh, five, I would have been able to clip, but didn't have to since I guess I picked the right way to get into that room. So I think the breakpoint's four to be able to clip. I know it is the screen wrap. Were there any bomb upgrades anywhere? Nope. I didn't see any. Yep. Um, Oppo found one and uh, noped out of it. What was that? I think it was seven. Far, far in our east of seven. I think I, I went up there via stair, but managed to miss that room somehow on the way to the Triforce. It was only like two or three from the Triforce. Mm. Yeah, really? Was... Huh. Yeah, I never saw it. I was on two bombs and didn't buy it because I wanted to keep my speed. That was a required stare in seven, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah it saying. was. Yeah. I, I know that for sure because I tried to bomb up and you couldn't bomb up. Yeah, that's right. It was the Goma room. That's right. Yep. Nice. So I picked the right way to go in there. That's good. Well, I'm on the other side of the mixed opinions, but uh, still played it out. Just uh Get some practice in. It was a good time. Hey, I love the I love the strategy divergence. Just because it doesn't work doesn't mean it was wrong. Yeah, the weekly is a good time to try out stuff. Like I went to I went Death Mountain early. Seven was the first dungeon I found because for some reason I decided let's do Death Mountain early because I got uh, I got a bomb on my first enemy kill. I was like, let's do Death Mountain. Uh, yeah, and I found seven and was key blocked. And I was like, this was a terrible idea. Yeah, that dolled on me too. Yeah, I tried to do Death Mountain early, but I messed up my bomb counts. So I, I had one bomb and no more enemies I could kill easily because I'm killing blue dark nuts on the overworld. My bomb think, count. The other thing I could never route back in was the any key. And by the time I could actually get close to it, I think I had nine. So just like, well. What's the point of walking to this at this point? I actually, as soon as I got the ladder out of five, I I wasn't really key starved, but I, for whatever reason in my mind, it's like, well, I'm just going to leave and just go get my any key because I know it's there. Yeah, I think I had like 200 rupees at that time and I was uh, up in the northeast corner. And I was like, you know what? Normally I wouldn't do this, but I can go really fast. So this will not take any time at all. But this was fun. This was a fun flag set just to kind of, you know, we, we've we been doing the tournament flag sets for what feels like kind of three months now, and it's nice. Forever. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but it's nice to spice it up with some variants here and there, and yeah, this was fun. It was a good de-rusting for me, because I've been out of town the past several days, so haven't played since what, Tuesday? Monday, Tuesday? So this was a nice de-rust. Yeah. GG's, everyone, and thanks for comms and tracking and Restreams and I'm gonna head off of here. Have a good night, everyone. Same. GG's, everybody. Uh, this was fun. See you all next week. Yep. I echo that. Thanks for comms and tracking. And thank you for chat for uh, chilling with us, having some fun on a Sunday night. Hope you did enjoy yourself. Otherwise, I don't imagine why you were here. But uh, anyways, Kairos, been fun. It's been good. And we'll see y'all next week. We'll have something else in store for. A flag set. Dun dun dun. Let's see. No, no, no. Nothing uh, planned as of yet. Stay tuned. Check the Discord. All that good stuff. Good night, everybody.